Hey, good morning everybody and welcome back to the channel. So today we have very bright sunlight out and I'm going to compare that Harbor Freight panel to that Harbor Freight panel and see how many watts it puts out while it's charging. So anyway, my jackery there, which is not on right now. But if you want to see my other video where I did it uh, with a cloudy day, the uh, I have a link up in the top corner or and you can click on it and check it out hey good morning everybody i hope you can hear me okay there's somebody cutting some trees down in the background today which is a nice sunny day so people are going to be out doing some work but today i'm going to compare my 13 watt solar panel to my 100 watt solar panel and we're going to be charging this jackery my 300 explorer and see what kind of output i'm getting from these two on a sunny day now, I did a video last week, and the link's going to be up above, wherever that pop-out is up there. And you can check that video out to see what happens on a cloudy day. And also, I've ordered some cables to combine some uh, panels together. I'm going to pick up a couple more of these this week and see what I can get, you know, see how close I can get to the 300 watts that it calls for. Because they say it's 100 watts each, and I want to get about 10 of these. So I'm buying them one or two or three at a time per month so I can, uh, you know, put them together and get me a little solar array going. So without further ado, let's hook this up to the Jackery and see what it's putting out. Now, last time I had a fan hooked up to this and you can see that it was pulling about 58 to 60 watts. But today I'm just going to plug these into the Jackery and see what it's charging without having a load on it. So let's do that and see how it works out. So now the first thing I'm going to do is plug this 100 watt panel into the jackery. And then we're going to turn on the display here. And wow, that's a lot better. That is a lot better. Hope you can see that okay. I will zoom in. So there, see that's putting, that's charging 68 watts. That's pretty doggone good. <laughs> 68 watts. Now, one thing I was curious about, you can see it's charging 68 watts. But I want to cover up part of that panel because some of these panels, even if you cover one little section, there's a couple of things I want to check. On that solar panel, uh, on the older ones, if you cover up any part of that, it will uh, completely stop it from charging. So I'm going to cover it up and see how much it drops down. I'm going to move you over closer to the panel, to the uh, jackery, so you can see what's going on there. And now let's see if it's charging. Uh, see, it went to zero. It went to zero. So they have not fixed that on the solar panels from Harbor Freight. And remove the shade from it. Let's see if it comes back back up. It's not doing anything right now. Let me turn the fan on. Okay now. So it stopped charging for some reason. It stopped charging. I don't know why. But I turned the fan on. The fan's pulling 43 watts. And the panel's uh, charging 68 watts. So now I'm going to cover that panel up again. Just a little bit of it and see if it changes. And we'll check it out. So I covered a small portion of it. It went down to one watt, but let's see if it comes back up because I walked in front of it, so that might have something to do with it. Let's give it a second to see if it'll catch up. So you see how much I have it covered up there, just the very edge of it there, down at the end. But they have not corrected that problem, and they need to do that because that's an issue. So now I removed that, 
and it jumps right back up to 58 watts. So it's charging more than it's using. This is why you need a battery backup with a couple of solar panels at your house, even a small unit like this. So that's why you need, even if it's a small unit, a, a 300 Jackery, you can see that you can run, if you're doing computers and phones and radios and things like that, you can do a lot with a Jackery 300 because I'm pulling, pulling 42 watts with the fan and that little 100 watt panel is putting out 53. Let me move it around a little bit and see if I can get more out of it. Now I changed the I changed the slope of it and it's getting 50 51 watts. I got a couple of leaves in front of it. Okay, now it's 57 watts. <laughs> 57 watts. So the angle of the panel is crucial. I hope you can see that okay. 57 watts. That is fantastic. 58 watts. So now it's charging 58 watts. And it's and the fan's using 42. So that's pretty good. That's pretty good, pretty good, pretty good. So now I'm gonna hook up this 13 watt panel and see what it does with full sun. 58 watts, that's pretty good. But it's still ain't, that's only a little over 50% of what they claim at 100. So now, I'm gonna unplug this one and plug this one. Okay, the zero. So now it's a 13 watt panel and it is charging 5 watts and let me adjust it a little bit. Got it pointed a little bit more like the other panel and it's still putting out 5 watts. I'm going to lay it flat on the ground and see what it does. Okay, so there it went to 3 watts. Keep an eye on that. I'm going to adjust this panel a little bit and see what it does. Four watts, five watts, still at five watts. So this is a pretty sunny day. I don't think I'm gonna. I mean, we might do a little better in the summer. This is spring. And it's putting out five watts. It's supposed to be 13 watt system. Not too far. It's four watts. So with it at that angle. With the fan running, pulling 41 watts, the little 13 watt panel on a full sunny day is putting out 5 watts. Okay, so now that I rearranged it a little bit, it's 69 watts from the 100 watt panel. That's 70 watts. That's pretty good. So yeah, you can run a lot of stuff off of that Jackery 300 with just one solar panel. That is fantastic. 
this video was informative to you. If it was, give me a thumbs up and subscribe to the channel. But a 100 watt panel will put out 70 watts on a sunny day. And I think if it's adjusted good and up on the roof, it'll put out a lot more. But man, you can get a Jackery and a 100 watt solar panel and have all the power you need for your electronics, a fan, and some small stuff. But I'm just impressed. I mean, it's not putting out 100 watts like the box says, but I'm standing in front of it right now. But, get over here. That's 70, 71 watts. And the fan's pulling 41 watts. I mean, how much better can it be? Anyway, thanks for watching. I'll have another video for you soon. You guys have an awesome day, baby. I'm a fuller work.